my journey of games, I have stumbled onto funny little games and wondered if this might have a deep, dark secret. Welcome to That's Not Your Neighbor. In the world of That's Not Your Neighbor, it is common practice to have an entrance guard to your housing, which in this case is me. Why? There may or may not be a small epidemic. No, don't worry, it is not a virus, also not political powers that want to inject you with unresearched liquids. That might be true. I don't know. <laughs> no, because of life and death is on the line and only me can. Me can? Only me can? Me? Only I can stop it. You know what a young entrepreneur like me likes. Exactly. Cold, hard achievements. As apparently in that communist country we are in, money is no such thing. But jobs are, so we most likely are investing into the stock market with potatoes or something. I don't know. But at least it allows us to breathe another day. So my life and the life of our dear neighbors is in my capable hands. <laughs> oh, yeah! On our totally not first day of the job, we get an intro to this magical job and get an introduction to our whimsical world as the god of this here house. Thank god I listened to what I was told in the intro. How the fuck did this happen? Oh, uh, maybe because I might have un misunderstood the assignment and might or might not have sent everyone who was a mutant here to eat my neighbors and me to the flats and put every extra person via express VIP call right into <coughs> God's capable arms. I am so going to prison. Wait, everyone is dead. Or I might be going to hell. So, let's not do this again. We this time look at everything the story has to offer, and that tells us that evil beings are impersonators of our neighbors. And our job is to actually protect the building from the monsters, not the people. Slight misunderstanding. So I was looking really closely at the people, and did not send them into an execution if they didn't look strange enough. Someone is gonna take this sentence out of context and make me look racist. Send them into an execution if they did look strange enough. Enough! I get it. Phrasing. Power now, demonetized state, and the entire liberal army I have to fight at my doorstep now. We finish our first day by executing just a few. Stop! Not like that! By taking care of six. Six, six, six weird demon things. And thus, achieve our first S rank. And as you might say, now, isn't it way too easy to win at this game if it is so obvious that someone is obviously a shit-faced version? I said stop, you're gonna get us banned for fuck's sake. As I said, if someone is just a bad imitation of another, isn't that way too easy? And you might be right, it is fairly doable, but don't forget, we are in a communist-driven country, where we pay our people in minutes you are allowed to go to bed. So of course we get what everyone else has. PSYCHOLOGICAL DAMAGE! I mean, sure, we all had nightmares, right? Like, how bad can this- Oh my fucking god, what in Disney's green fuck is this shit? <laughs> I'm in danger! This is my happy little accident of happy little slightly fucked up in the head people called viewers is my personal fucking hell designed by SATAN HIMSELF! <laughs> if it wasn't hard enough to see that one person had a mole more than usual, or were missing one single number on their ID. These shits have the most fucked up physiology, physiology, physio, physio. One eternity later. Physiology, 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 physiology. Fuck. <laughs> Physiology. <laughs> Known to fucking man. Some of them might just look slightly different, and what I mean by that is look the fucking same. Fuck. But I mean, 
what was what, what, what was I supposed to do? See the fuckhead McGee was supposed to have one less fucking tattoo on his already totally not fucking 50! I mean, just be a little fucked up. Because we are literally inside the mind of... Uh, or in a nightmare, I mean... The fuck am I supposed to know? For all I know, we might as well be inside of an asylum of a fucking nut job. So, if it wasn't clear, nightmare mode is a fucking nightmare. So I decided to do my very fucking best. <laughs> well, at least you don't get punished for just sending people to hell. Hell? Where do people go if you die when you're already dead? I guess you go to work. I don't know. Don't ask me. I'm the Reaper, not God. Oh, no, uh, you absolutely do get punished for everything you do wrong. Oh, great! Just, just like I like it. It's really fun, you know? It's really enjoyable if you just kick yourself in the nuts for like a couple of good hours. Yeah, boy! Ah. So, after just a few dozen... Again. Unsuccessful attempts of getting fucked from behind. Did I ha did I really have to write this? Now I can't unsee it. Fuck me. Fuck sake. Oh. Fuck. Fuck this. <laughs> After being equal to our god-given hero Henry, you most likely don't know who he is. We survive and encounter this fat fucking clown. And by all that I know. I don't know much, but all I know, I know to call the cops on this guy. Fuck you. I take it back. By all I know, I have played a good old simplified version of Durak from the good old times as a small Russian gobnik. Oh well, good that I never lose to you fucking if- <laughs> Suck my balls! Can I now go back? <laughs> Go back to your obese country, but I want to go home, man. I, what the fuck is even going on anymore? But even though I literally beat my communist nightmare, this isn't enough. I need the secrets. I need to know more information that can get me killed. So I kept on playing. I might, it might be 4 a.m. in the morning because I suck at this game. But nothing makes me as awake as knowing that the FBI is personally asking me for my end. Ad huh? Is personally asking me for my address. No, I need more. I need the secrets. I need to know what does it mean where do they come from why is this guy a thing who are you why are you even why is someone like me even in this position who the fuck said i was qualified for this job fuck where where am i why is someone like me in this position for real for all I know, I haven't found the true meaning of my life. Why? Where? Who? When? Cancel that, I know when. Still, what even is going on? I need to die!